Bill DeRoche and Byron James are guests. They are hosting a show on CKNW Radio called West, West Coast, Coast Wheels and Ink. Flows mm -hmm. nicely, doesn't it? It does. It does. It works. Uh, uh, now, as far as callers go, um, lots of women? Well, you know what? What we've done uh, is we've tried to make it as uh, interactive as possible, and we've really kind of focused on Facebook. I mean, it's mm -hmm. everywhere that, and and being on Twitter and getting people to communicate that way because it's almost faster than using the phones because we can, as one of us is answering a question or talking, we can Working. be online also, which is oh, fantastic. Oh, great! Yeah. yeah, so interactive. Yes. Now, do people ask you questions about pistons and do they still have pistons in cars? Uh, yeah, yeah, they still. I do. know that. Except they do. for except they for do. rotaries, <laughs> no That's pistons good. in a rotary. Really? Yeah. And it's all computerized now. So who knew uh, that yeah. there wouldn't be a gasket? Hmm. Well, are there still gaskets? Oh yeah. Well, a <laughs> lot of a, there is still gaskets, but a lot they've eliminated a lot of gaskets in the newer motors with just very finely machined surfaces and right. Okay. Well, all I know is when I was a teenager, I tripped over my boyfriend's gasket for his 1940 something and ripped it. Yeah. It's and much it junk. was hard to find one from a, for a 1940 car. Sure. I was not pleased. A lot we of, nearly a lot broke of those up gaskets, over that. Yeah, a lot of those older stuff, you mm -hmm. have to make it yourself. You're sure. definitely not buying it. I guess. Yeah. Uh, so somebody brings you a Plymouth Barracuda in 1970. I know someone did. Yes, they did. We uh, completely tore the car apart, replaced every piece of sheet metal in it. Um, we custom designed there everything it on it. Um, and the color yeah, is black? It. It's a, yeah, it's a metallic black. That's what I thought. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's a really cool color. It's kind of a, a custom mix sort of thing that we did. And um, yeah, it's a it's, it's, it's pretty spectacular mm. car. Mm. That's probably my favorite car that we've built um, to date. And it definitely gets- Big engine? Yeah, it's got a big Hemi in it. Uh, Which means it's a 525 it's Arusa Hemi, um, and it sounds it, it sounds powerful. Nasty. It sounds. I know nasty. you just turn them on, you go go boom. Oh yeah, that thing will set off car alarms and mm -hmm. uh, will definitely raise eyebrows if you drove it down here. I'm sure. Well, I have a wealthy friend who has an Aston, and they sure. have a tuner yep. at the shop. Yep. So mm -hmm. and you can have it tuned to how you want it to sound. It's the same, yeah. it's the same with us. I mean, Is all it? The, yeah, all the cars get dyno tuned. They're all done by a computer. I mean, it's, there's no, the carburetor thing is, is gone. Now it's all electronic engine controls. How interesting. So if you want your car to sound higher or lower or sing a country song. Yeah. Well, <laughs> it, it doesn't get that <laughs> quite that in depth, but um, you can definitely tailor mm -hmm. how the car drives. You know, you can right. tune it so it'll go through air carry. You can tune it for power. You can tune it for drivability. Sure. There's there's a lot of variables that, that with the new technology, it gives us the ability to kind of tailor a car towards exactly. your owner. And what about the new muscle cars? Oh, well, there's... They're awesome. They're wicked. <laughs> well, what? They're lighter. They're faster. You know, it's it's okay. Great. Like what? Ford Mustang. You the more, said the Ford Mustang, the GT five hundreds. Um, we've done work on those. Uh, you can make a ton of horsepower out of those cars with with bolt ons without even opening the motor. Um, the new Camaro. I haven't played with that yet, but we have a customer actually that's buying one today or uh, Monday and bringing it mm. in, and we're gonna try our hand at that. Okay, so when you say try your hand at it, they, they bring in the car, Yep. the brand new car, Yeah. and you tweak it? Do you put those loud things, those loud uh, speakers in it? Uh, no, Is that well, your we problem? do, we do, <laughs> we can do it. Um, sure. Most of my customers are more performance oriented. Right. So, you know, I mean the stereo stuff, we do a lot of stereos. When we do a complete custom build on a car from start to finish, mm -hmm. I always put a big stereo in it. But um, no, this individual is going to be more looking for making right. some power and, and sure. performance out of it. So, well, what could you do to the wrap? Oh, jeez, crush he, it! He, he would chop it. He crush put, it. He put a, the, crush he, it. He probably put a uh, with the back end of a, a <laughs> Humvee or something. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I don't That's even know just, what you do. It's with just it. not your car. Well, what for him, do? I'd put some pink sea covers on it. And Hello Kitty <laughs> steering wheel. But. Hello Kitty stickers. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. Well, I well, have an eight-year-old daughter, so that works. Of course. But I think he's making. Oh, a it's day the new me. pony, isn't it? That's I, the new hot show I for think kids. So. The I, little pony, the new pony. I don't know. My house. Something like that. My house has got all boys. And I don't have any honors, Oh, so. and are you boys car nuts? Uh, no, actually not yet. Not no. My one son wants to be a chef, and the other one's not quite sure what he's doing yet. Mm -hmm. So, and that's the, how it goes. The youngest yeah. one's too young to know yet. So, sure. What do you drive? Um, I've got an F three fifty Harley truck, diesel, Ooh. and um, a Harley. 
Mm. Are any of these muscle cars green? Uh, or I mean mm. fuel efficient? Well, they're getting better. Yeah, for fuel well, all, all the newer stuff, all the newer mm. stuff like this Camaro, the Mustangs. Right. Um, most of the cars, like we've transplanted new Hemi's into older cars. Um, they're definitely way better on fuel than you know the old school, sure. and they make more power. So okay. the new technology stuff is definitely you know get five six hundred horsepower and still get twenty miles to the gallon, right? Right. So. And interior wise, do you have a preference? Leather, leather, pleather. It's got to be leather. Mm. Velvet. No substitute. No. Leather. <laughs> no leather. It's got to be leather. No, seat belts. Uh, yeah, pleather. It's just not the same. I know. No. Don't you stick to pleather? You can't get out. Well, of it. a lot of the newer vinyls. Are, <laughs> a lot of the newer vinyls are really Let's keep that good, going. Yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. Well, I was sat in the Rolls Phantom when uh, the head of Rolls Royce was in town, and I'll tell you, wow. yeah. a girl could get used to that. No, well, I sure. bet she I could. It. Or a Bentley, or you know. Any of those. With the driver. Mm-hmm. Okay, so what's the future for this show? Where do you want to take it? Well, what we would dream. Love, what we would love to do with the show is, we're just starting out, so you know we've just been born four weeks ago. Mm -hmm. uh, we would like the show to become a hub for all three of the different topics that we right. have. So right now you've got um, websites and and uh, different shops that are out there that are all, you know, doing their cars, doing their bikes, doing the tattoos. Nobody's ever taken brought it together. Brought exactly, together. brought them all together. Mm -hmm. So what we would like to do is we would like to make the show a hub and very interactive, not only uh, for the radio, but make it you know on the internet and whatnot, so people know where to go to find out what's going on. Or let's say they want to go to a customized shop, we direct them to whatever you know kind of suits their needs. And eventually, we would love to you know end up doing a TV show. Yeah, being mm. on TV. Yeah. Well, you look good on TV. You just well, never know. I got more hair than Bill, so I... And I'm better looking. So. Yeah, well, so. we'll have to discuss. <laughs> we'll have to figure that out. Maybe we'll take a poll. Yeah. We'll get some, there we'll, you go. Let's get some tweets. Yeah. Sure, Come we can in. figure it out. Mm, thank you so much. No thank problem. you. Nice to meet both of you. Pleasure. Nice to meet you. Thanks a lot. Bill DeRoger and Byron James, West Coast Wheels and Ink on CKNW Radio this Saturday, uh, 6 to 7. And they can talk Canucks. We can. You can. Yep. We, who knew Trevor Linden drove a Mustang? There we are. You know.